Taiwan today will be a very quick opening. So we have opened the Disney 100 set for White Source. There is another Disney set that was released for White Source Blau, which is supposed to be a simplified version of White Source. So anyway, uh, here is the breakdown. I think the highest rarity you can get is the MKR and the PSR. And there are 13 SPs as well and 20 DYR and 26 BR. Wow. Uh, not familiar that much with White Source Blau since I don't open a lot of this. And since I got quite a bit burned by the prices for the Disney 100 sets, I didn't get uh, many boxes for this uh, Disney set for White Source Blau. Just one box, just to see the kind of cards uh, we have in this set. And uh, compared to, a, of course, you know, a standard White Source uh, boosters, this has also a lot less uh, cards. So first off, oh, very nice box topper promo of Beauty and the Beast. Yeah, I love the artwork. Somehow, you know, for White Source Blau, they use a lot more original artwork that they make rather, you know, than screen captures from uh, the animation, the cartoons, or the anime itself. So that's really nice. I mean, I really appreciate they put the effort into card design. So, of course, compared to our packs, we have like 2, 4, 6, 8, 10. Almost like half the packs from our standard boosters. And our booster itself have even lesser cards, like half the cards from our White Source boosters as well. So I guess it is to keep the cost of the product low, so then there will be like lower barriers to entry. So that was their intention with the whole White Source Blau line. So we do see Bambi, Beauty and the Beast, Ooh, Zootopia. So this is a BR, so BR has very nice uh, foil stem. And I just realized, you know, for BR, wow, look at that stem. And for BR normally, you know, there is a full art uh, with the foil stem and then uh, the cut effect is actually at the back. So I really have no idea uh, how this would work uh, in the actual game. I'm guessing that you can't use transparent sleeves like this. You probably need to use something opaque. But then you don't get to see this very nice uh, full art of the character. So I really have no idea how that works. Okay, we do have... Oh, we have foils as well. So, uh, Frozen. Uh, foil cut from Zootopia. Lilo and Stitch as well, Mickey. Oh, even Baymax. We need a pool. And Wreck It Ralph. Wow, good mix here. Another foil. Tigger from We Need a Pool. Okay, I mean, low key, I kind of wish that I got the more boxes now that I've seen how the cards look like. But it's okay. There are too many sets and too little money. Oh wow! The double rare looks really nice. Look at that. At first I was thinking what rarity is this? It's our Cinderella double rare. Wow, oh, I mean, I kind of wish uh, the double rares for White Source now look as good. <laughs> I kind of really like the card designs for White Source uh, Blau a lot with this set. Okay, maybe I might open more White Source Blau products in the future, but so far I haven't seen any of the set that interests me. Uh, this is the rare, you know, Disney set. Oh, look at that. Moana, rare. Like I said, uh, not screen captures or anything. Very nice original artwork. That's what I can appreciate. Aladdin. Oh, we need a pool. Very nice uh, drawing of the a sketch of Christopher Robin and Pooh. Okay. Dawn of Dark. Ooh, even the Nightmare Before Christmas. Wow, Cinderella. The climax look very good and goofy. So yeah, a good mix of series as well. Okay, the Little Mermaid. Lion King. The foils look good. Even like base variety foils like this. Zootopia. Tangled. Oh, the Aristocrat cats as well. Pinocchio. Double rare. We need a pool. A little mermaid. Okay. Okay, so another BR rarity. This time our Daisy Duck. And then we have our Snow White and the Seven Dwarf uh, Climax. So yeah, you can see cut effects at the back. But I mean, compared to that Zootopia stem, I think uh, the Z one is a bit simple, but hey, at least we have two of those. So it seems like the pool rates are a lot more generous. Minimally, you should be getting a BR rarity, I think, with every box. Oh wow, this is a DYR rarity. Okay, cheap and deal as well. 
and Aladdin. No idea how rare this is, but look at that very nice Disney stamp, Donald Duck and Daisy. But unfortunately, the background isn't textured. But because it's a DYR rarity, I'm guessing it is somewhat special. Maybe I should double sleeve this just in case. Really, no idea. Okay. So there we have it, Disney, back of the card. Okay, let's look again at the rates. So okay, DYR rarity we have 20, so it is slightly rarer than a BR, but not as rare as an SP. Okay, still pretty really decent. So yeah, this is a very quick opening. So I guess uh, in terms of double rare, we only have two per box, Cinderella, we need a pool. But we also have two very nice uh, hot stamp cards uh, that are the BR rarity. So full art characters on the back with some nice uh, foil stamp. I really love the Zootopia stamp. And then the cards with the effect is at the back. Then of course, apart from that, we have also put a DYR rarity. Disney rare, I believe. So yeah, quite happy even though we only have open one box today. Not sure if the rates are really more generous compared to Wise Source or did I got lucky here today. But I think minimally you should be getting a BR rarity like uh, the cards we see over here. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you're not subscribed to the channel, now is a really good time to do so because we have a lot of products that we are opening for the month of July. But these are products that were released in June but only got them now because of the consolidated shipping. So like I said, I'm also doing a giveaway. All you have to do is to make sure you are subscribed to the channel and just leave your comments on any of the videos that I'll be posting up in July and I will be doing a draw for a winner uh, towards the end of July. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this very quick opening and see you all next time. Bye now!